what they call me. Promise that you never be lonely. What's up, everybody? This is your boy, Timothy Apollo. I just want to have a few words with you guys about the COVID-19 situation. We will survive, okay? We've been doing these situations forever in the day, from medieval times um, with the bubonic plague, AKA the black plague. And remember, we didn't have none of these medicines around. Them guys lived in filth back then. Washing hands? <laughs> More like washing ass back then, okay? Excuse my language. That's first of all. Second of all, we've had the avian flu, aka the bird flu. We've had SARS. You guys name it, we've had it, okay? But again, we survived it. Now, I know this stuff is scary. Everybody's washing their hands, all extra and everything, what we weren't doing at first, which is what we should have been doing. I kid you guys not. I was in the restroom today at the gas station. I seen this guy and I could not make this up to you guys, okay? I seen this brother. You know, he was he was, you know, um what's what's the what's the proper term for it nowadays? I guess you could say straight challenge, you know, alternate lifestyle. Hey, you know, I don't know. Anyway, this dude had a cotton swab and he was and I was like, huh? <laughs> he looked at me like, yeah, you better get some, Negro. So I'm like, okay, cool. Anyway, point is, is this. Let me let you guys know what to look for, okay? And I'm not trying to be Negro HD or nothing. I'm just saying like, MD, I'm sorry, MD. I'm just saying like, let me throw this y'all away, okay? Cough, fever, tiredness, difficulty breathing, okay? Sometimes it can be severely from what I'm reading right here. Now here's the deal, people. Some people may not have these symptoms at all. We have to watch out for this stuff. You know, we really do. Keep your loved ones close, and if they're elderly, keep them at a distance. I'm sorry to say this, call them. Use FaceTime, whatever you have to do, but if they are elderly or they've just had surgery or they've got a compromised immune system, then hey, this stuff can be severe for them. I'm just being real. That's why social distancing is a must right now, people. Just for the moment, okay? Until we get this stuff under control. Now, I'm gonna let you guys know this right now. Believe it or not, the numbers are up, okay? We've had a total, as you guys can see, we've had a total of 551,337 confirmed cases of this. And that was since eight hours ago. The death toll on this is 24,906. Condolences, really. On better news, the total amount of people who's recovered is 127,564 people. So yes, this is rampant. Yes, this is a situation. But like I say, people remember, we've been through plenty of these things before. This isn't going to be the first nor the last time. We just haven't had this much of an outbreak before, you know. So the most important part is to keep in touch with your family members. Keep check up on them. Make sure nobody's having these symptoms. Tiredness, shortness of breathing, fever, flu-like symptoms. And regardless of what, some people may not have these symptoms at all. So, at the end of the day, everybody, it's about just being vigilant about this situation. You know it's going to all blow over after a while, and hey, you can go back to your normal lives. But at the end of the day, keep one thing in mind. Stay clean. Wash, wipe. You know, this stuff can survive on countertops, on hard surfaces for 24 hours. Yeah, 24 hours. Keep your hands out of your face, you know? Watch who you drink behind. A lot of these things can be prevented, you know, not just eliminated, I'm sorry. But a lot of this stuff can and will be prevented following those simple cleaning tips. And I know it may sound like something simple, but think about this. How often were we doing this before this hit, you know? Remember, be like uh, be like him downstairs who I met in the bathroom, <laughs> you know. I mean, I kid you not, this brother had a cotton swab. 
So, you know, I'm like, I'm like, damn. You know, is it that serious? And I say, oh, damn, yeah. <laughs> so, hey, anyway, people, look at this. This is Timothy Apollo. Just giving you guys a few words, a few of the warnings. Just keeping you guys up on, you know, the toe of where we're at. Like, subscribe, share. <laughs> Him downstairs. <laughs>